Well, SABC News is monitoring traffic flow at the Bedbridge border post at um, Sina Lumpopo. Uh, thousands of people are continuing to queue there, wanting to enter South Africa from Zimbabwe. Earlier this week, Home Affairs officials were at the Bedbridge border post monitoring the congestion as scores of holidaymakers returned home. Our reporter, Pimani Beloy, is at the border crossing. We are at the Bike Bridge border post in Mosina, Limpopo, which has been topping trend lists on social media, with many social media users calling it a humanitarian crisis. The situation here has been that scores of Zimbabwean nationals who work and live in South Africa have been queuing on the other side of the border post, wanting to enter South Africa. This, as Zimbabwe yesterday went into a hard lockdown, which is anticipated to block people from moving freely from outside the country to this country here. What we've seen is that many of the people who have been queuing say they've spent nights and days queuing in Zimbabwe hoping to be assisted. They are saying that since the lockdown, officials only process them during the day up until 7 in the evening, which has cost some of them, some which I might add, have babies on their backs to queue and sleep on queues for more than two days. Some of them were able to get in today and were able to speak to them and they told that stories of how the situation is dire in their country and how economically they cannot afford to survive and be locked down in this country. So many of them are queuing, hoping to get into South Africa as early as possible. We'll be speaking to some of them and bringing, them, bringing you, our viewers, some of their views. But for now, it's back to you in studio.